Ah, so the Saturday, P3W, it's all on the line at Thumb Wars over at In Conjunction 43. If I lose this next match, even though this is just a tournament match, if I lose my next match, I will no longer be allowed to be a combatant for P3W for an insurmountable amount of time. And of course they have my opponent being none other than your imaginary best friend. He's back. That's right. Mr. Bizarro Lucha himself, Trip Cassidy. Now I will say Trip, you are somewhat of a hero of mine. When I left in 2010, I left because I wasn't accepted. My ideals, my experiments, myself in general was not accepted in the mass wrestling community. And it wasn't until just a couple years ago, a handful of years ago, when I discovered Bizarro Lucha, your little experiment. I saw how successful it was and I saw how accepting everybody was of it. And it looked like something that I was trying to do back in the day. And it made me want to come back to the ring. And I loved it and I couldn't wait to have the day, the chance, when I could step my foot into a Bizarro Lucha wrestling ring. But unfortunately, that wasn't able to happen. And you left a void, and so I decided to fill that void myself with my own experiments. With the Badass Pro, when we did Panic at the Dojo, we also had Cabin Fever, amongst other matches, and then we also decided to hold Pollock's Power Pro Professional Thumb Wrestling, P3W. And now that you're back, I welcome you to P3W. But you are my opponent. And if you do defeat me, I do not get to participate in my wonderful little adventure. So, Trip, I will do everything I can to defeat you. I think it's crazy that they decided to uh, put you against me. But you know, it's how the entity is now that they're in control. But I did have a clause in our match. I got to decide our stipulation. You see, I'm still allowed to experiment. And this wonderful little experiment has been successful on my end twice. So now we're gonna try it a third time. It is the Ratlocks Toy Box match. Now, if you're wondering what that is, just Give you a little clue. You can either see it on the first Panic at the Dojo from the Badass Pro, or you can even see it at Schlockfest, at Pillfest from last year, when I used it against the Oni. Uh, for a quick little rundown, just think, if Gallagher and Carrot Top were to face each other in a hardcore match, what kind of weapons do you think that they would create against each other? <laughs> I'm going to have a couple of those with me. I intend to use every single one on you. This is not going to be a match that you will have been a part of before. You may not be ready for me. I may not be ready for you. We're both a little crazy, right? I think we're going to give the fans exactly what they want. And hopefully, science willing, I will be coming out on top and making it to the next rung. And I will continue my professional thumb wrestling career. But if not, honestly, there's nobody else that I would rather lose it to than the person who brought the spark back for me. Good luck, Trip. Let the experiment begin. <laughs> One, two, three, four.